I'm Sam Ward, and this is Nick Hollow. This is the story of Tom the Robot. There once was a metal kingdom, and there lived a robot king and a robot queen, and a newly made little robot boy named Tom. Shortly after, Tom became part of a family a war raged over. The metal castle fell to the ground. Both the king and the queen were held in a prison that they would never see the outside of again. The, the young robot was awoken next morning in the ruins of what once was a majestic metal castle. The boy not knowing for who he was, for his memory was forgotten, because he was badly damaged. For now, young Tom is on his own. He was scared of being only six. He tried endlessly to remember anything before the invasion. He took it upon himself to try to reach the closest spot of civilization. He traveled far and wide to seek a place of rest. It didn't take him long to recover, for he was determined on his way out he noticed a young blonde human girl he had never seen a human before tom continued on to find her and talk to her tom turned to run but was weak from his exploration he ran around the corner but quickly fled to the side of the building the red sash the enemy said to have captured the king and queen and held them hostage tom quickly scaled the building and ran away so he wasn't seen by the red sash he had thought to himself about the sash the sash had been pillaging the town for gold. Tom had found a sword thinking to himself and grabbed it and snuck back into the village. He saw the leader of the red sash holding the blonde girl half hostage. He felt courage and also he was surprised that he hadn't felt courage before. He walked up and confronted the leader. He said to the, he said to the boy, go home. He, so he didn't get hurt. Tom didn't move an inch and just started into the leader's eyes. He, the leader pushed the girl on, into one of the soldiers and grabbed her arms. Tom didn't even know the girl yet, but and he was fighting for her life. The leader shifted into battle phase with his sharp sword at hand. Tom drew his newly found blade and prepared for the worst to come. He threw himself at the leader and tried it for the a slash but the leader quickly quickly pulled back and knocked young tom when tom awoke he up he was in a he was chained up with, with the blonde girl the king and the queen and a man came to tell them that they would be punished tom quickly shivered in fear but the rest of them just seemed it was another day tom started to talk about the uh, talked to the queen, but stopped, but the queen stopped him at his first words. Uh, he quickly filled with happiness, but also sadness. The queen explained to Tom that he was their son. Tom froze at the thought, but also remembered he would be punished tomorrow by the red sash. He, he told them he had a way out and set to work. He finished his creation and explained to him it would blow up the building. The bomb was deployed and he blew up the base. He told them that the bomb couldn't hurt them, him because him and the queen, king and queen, because he was, they were made of the strongest metal in the world. They huddled around the girl to protect her, and then the building exploded. The very next morning, young Tom, once just a boy, now to be crowned prince, received a special medal for his bravery. Tom thanked the girl and told her she held a special place in his heart. The girl told Tom that she would find a way to repay him in the near future for saving her.